Hello and welcome back to the Beer Dog Reviews. As ever, I'm Chris and down there somewhere, there's Tyrion. I'm sure you've all heard him on my previous videos. Don't expect any less today. Now this time we have the Crate Session IPA. Look at that stunning can wrap. That's a lovely design there, isn't it? Uh, in previous years, I may have been put off by a heavily designed can wrap, you know, thinking of the preserve of hipsters and so on, but a lot of breweries these days do actually put some thought and effort into their design. So this one, just a light 3.6%. They say, all the big fruity flavours without the big ABV. Perfect for long afternoons. And even longer evenings. Well, let's have a little look, shall we? Let's get this one out and into a glass. Oh, it's a definite hoppy aroma there. That smells wonderful. Nice gentle pull. We don't want to overload that head. Even so, it's quite a strong head. It's a good, solid two, maybe even three finger white head there. But it does dissipate quite quickly. There's only a slight carbonation there, if you can see. If you can see on the camera or not. Yeah, yeah there's a lovely hop aroma coming through there. Let's just top it off. Now, oh. let's have a look, shall we? Hmm. It doesn't say what hot varieties they have used, but let's have a look. There's a very really mild citrus tone to that. I wouldn't be surprised if they've got some citra or maybe even some amarillo hop in there. There's a bit of fleshy white fruit, almost peachiness to that one. Maybe, maybe an Amarillo hop. I could be wrong, but who knows? Let's have a taste. Oh, yes, you've got the flavour, and yet it's maintaining the lightness. It's Definitely fruity. There is a very strong white fruit in there. Yeah, I would say there's a peach flavour in that one. It's balanced evenly by the hops, and yet not drowned out by the hops. That's crucial in a good IPA like this. It's well balanced. And that's the main thing. So, I can recommend this one highly. So, this is the uh, Crate Session IPA. This is cheers to you all. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. And you'll be able to see all the different beers that I review. So, cheers to you all.